Right, I'm gonna do a video on the succulent area of the garden. I inherited these succulents. I'm not a succulent person, but I did multiply these. This is a baby from that. I don't know what these are called. I think these, that's a hen and a chick. Hen and chick. A red one instead of a green one. And that one has babies. This is a cactus and it's grown. Okay. All of that area right there is newer. And then this cactus is from my mother-in-law's house in Southern California. I brought home a cactus for everybody. Well, all the girls anyway. And made them as Christmas gifts with decorations when Christmas and this is mine well my daughter claims it now but um it was just it was smaller than this one right here when I first brought it in and it's just multiplied and grown taller and it's lovely to remember my mother-in-law. This is a black olive down here in this bag. There are two. And you can bonsai olives. You can make them shrubs, bushes, or trees. And so putting those in that bag and see what happens. And then over here. is more succulent and more black olive. I put two black olives in there. So while we're waiting for the black olives to do something, we'll have a little bit of succulent activity at the same time. So this is babies from that other one. And this was the mother plant of that so this is a baby the babies are mine the other ones other people can have them so anyway this is the succulent area and it's not much but there's progress and i'm thrilled with all of us being there and praying that they do all right the one in the tan bag looks stronger than the one in tan bag. In the bucket. And actually, this soil is a lot more suited for the olive because of the rockiness. We'll see. All right. That's it.